Hey gang, Black Knight here, and in previous videos I had lamented the fact that you cannot set up scrapping stations at the Boston Airport or the Mechanist Lair, because they're both broken in the same way. You can't set up food, you can't set up scrapping stations, you can't make them full legitimate settlements, really. You can't really do all the things you can do to settlement at these two settlements, although they make excellent robot uh, spawn locations here for your... Uh, robot supply lines. It, I, it's interesting. Sometimes it puts all the supply lines to the pretty one, which makes me think perhaps the Brotherhood is stealing all my scrap. But let's let's go to the Boston airport and take a look at something. No more cams. Now, if you'd seen my, my previous video on the Boston airport, you know that I've set this up as a manufacturing facility with the intention that I would bring scrap here, dump it all into the workshop, and then have it make things like shotgun shells or denim dresses or you know whatever happens to come up you know potato chips there's all kinds of uh, different things can go on but i've noticed something very 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 interesting and i want to show that to you as soon as we get done looking at this guy's butt <sighs> let's do the time warp again okay here we are and we got all kinds of robots going here. I've been fixing them up little by little. Now, I think enough time should have passed. Now, what do you notice? See, there's a spine there, some crystal, some more crystal, a bag of cement. I did not put this scrap in here. I didn't do it. There is... There is junk actual junk in the workshop which means it's like there's scrapping stations or at least one it's creating its own junk and that that ladies and gentlemen is a wonderful thing that means this stuff could just feed right into uh, all of my manufacturing let's see first of all do we want to fix up any robots here before they walk away Identity captain omega corporal omega are any of these the uh Airport security too. I think we're gonna. I think we're gonna take airport security, the airport security robots, and we're gonna reassign them. I think we're gonna put them. Oh, here we have to go over here. I don't mean to be completely distracted, but I've been meaning to do this. Call up airport security too. We don't even have to fix them up. We just gotta grab them. We can fix them up eventually. Exit station, and then. Pop it into this mode here. Go command. Did you do oh, up higher? We gotta go up higher. I was just thinking, I've got these guys named Airport Security. And did I not set up I did not set up um, artillery? Let's set up artillery. Okay, we have to set up our artillery here. Special. Def we can't put artillery here? You can't even put artillery on this place? Well, that's in special, isn't it? What is it, by treaty? You can't set up... Okay, so one more way that this place is just totally broken. So there's no point in... We'll just leave the airport security out there. Oh, darn it. I want to move more robots here at some point. I've got more... Got some day tripper and stuff. Oh, Alright, that's a different different video. Maybe we'll even cut that out. But as you can see now, every time I come here, I mean really if I want to, I could just come here, go to the workshop, take the scrap, and then uh you know, go from there and just, just run with it. But I mean, you know, I could just let it all collect up in here. Look at all the stuff we've got. We've got, you know, let's go to transfer here. You can see how much junk is available. It, of course, it's collecting purified water, too, so I'm making a mint on that at some point. But look at all the junk. And because we're always pulling it out of there, it, there's no upper limit here for the storage. So we can have look, steel 278. Life is good. All right. At least that makes more sense than airport security. Airport baggage hand. Then he, that way it makes sense that he's on supply. We want to rev them up. We might as well rev them up. While we're here, let's go 
It kind of has a uh, button head armor. Where's the um, head actuator? That, I like that one. It looks so. Give it some stock stuff here. All right, some basic armor, an explosive minigun, a, a laser in his hand for backup. He's ready to go. Well, up to, they won't be airport security anymore. They'll be airport baggage handlers, and that makes them really good as far as doing their assigned task of being on supply lines. All right, now, sideline done. Or sidebar, really. Side, sidebar. The same thing can be noted here at the Mechanist Lair. If it ever loads. And here we are. Not as much robotic stuff I'm going on. Everybody concerned. must be out. But look at this. I've got this little section just of uh, some automation going on here just to suck the stuff out of the... Uh, out of the workshop. But as you can see, there's a lot of stuff here, and I did not put any of this in here. This is all just magically appearing in the workshop and then coming on out here, and again, we can see it. You keep doing that. You end up with a lot of stuff. So this is two completely free sources of junk. I mean, you don't need to set up, you know, the, uh, the production lines here. You don't need to do any of this. You just have to go in, grab every so often. But hey, if I do this, every time I come in, go to talk to, uh, the mechanist up there. Uh, I can, uh, you know, do I'm buying junk from her or going to get a robot mission? I'll be, you know, I'll be, this will be happening. You, know, you have to be here for it to crank the stuff out, which is the sad part. But it is cranking the stuff out, and I think this is, you know, just so I let you know that there is a free source of junk in the world where you don't really have to do anything. And on that wonderful note, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night. Roof now. That's like a thing. Keeping the streets safe.